I wanted to prepare my SD card not directly by using P, but using the Docker image that I've just learned how to use, and I have my Ubuntu installed on it. But mounting the drives didn't really work out, so I'll go ahead and try to do it directly on Pi, and we'll see what happens. Basically, what I was trying to get at is, don't use Docker to install Arch on your SD card. Um, I ran into all sort of errors, plus it is really inconvenient for me to use Docker in general, since uh, I need to run command by command, which is fine for what I generally use Docker for, but yeah, don't use it. And naturally we'll go ahead and install Arch directly onto Pi. I start by downloading Arch to my Pi. Afterwards I deal with partitions, which resulted in a whole lot of nothing. Basically, after fucking up the partitioning, I decide to try all of that again, of course leading to another failure. After that I switch to my laptop in order to indirectly install Arch on my SD card. Also another benefit of switching to all of that was just how slow everything was on Pi, like even the most mundane tasks were a struggle. Currently in the process of downloading Arch Linux for the third time now, I fucked up the partitions twice on Raspberry. And now we're going super user on my laptop, so I really hope I don't fuck anything up. First of all, I had some permission errors. Although there's probably a way around that, I simply decided to start over. And at that time, I fully understood the whole process of what I should be doing. So now instead of following the tutorials, uh, I went free roaming. I can also say that I thought I'm done with all that. And in the end, that couldn't be further away from the truth. I think mounting the image finally worked for the fourth time, so we're gonna try booting it up for the first time and we'll see what happens. I'm not sure whether it's gonna work or not, but I think it should work. I don't know, we'll see. I'm not too sure what I did, but for the first time we actually got the Raspberry screen pop up. I stopped recording the process at some point, because it was just a bunch of scrolling, and the interesting part really is the fact that even though my execution was perfect, it still wouldn't boot. I seriously didn't think it takes so long for me to get the boot up screen, but I guess I'm kind of retarded. Um, nonetheless, I got some sort of reaction out of myself at the end, and after the final bit I'll just end the video right here. After about 14 attempts and about 12 hours, we finally get to see the Arch Linux boot up screen. Just a few moments ago, I was actually screaming of happiness. I was just so fucking happy. So yeah, I guess I still don't know how I'll edit this video, but I will. And we'll see how that shit turns up. But until that, I think that's more than enough for the first episode. So yeah, goodbye and see ya.